Okay, so first we start off with an ornament, it's clear. Um, I went ahead and painted it, but yeah, you'll paint the inside and let it dry, do a couple coats, and yeah, that's how it'll look. That's how we'll start it off. Now we're gonna go ahead and glue in the foam to the inside. That's gonna work as our base, and that's where we'll be gluing all of the things that, for our terrarium. And so we'll set that in there. Also, just make sure to be careful when using a hot glue gun. So now we're gonna add the little support so that way it doesn't wobble anymore. It's just like a little wooden disc. Um, so glue it. If you'd like to, you can paint it. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it as is, but feel free to decorate. So add it to the bottom. And that's it. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and start assembling and putting together um, the terrarium. I'm gonna glue the moss. And you can use whatever you'd like, whatever you have at home, sticks, rocks, uh, fake moss, and some um, faux plants that I'm gonna use. Um, and it's a good thing um, to lay out your, um, you know, where you're gonna put everything to make sure it can close as well. So get an idea and before you start gluing, um, and that's it. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and start working on the river. I really like how it looks in the terrarium, so I'm gonna add that to mine. And what I'm gonna do is use the glue gun to create um, the river, make it look more, much more realistic. And I'll just make several layers. I'll wait for one layer to dry, then add another one. So here you see me again, going in and adding more. Um, and it's really up to you how you um, want to decorate your terrarium, but I like the whole river in there. It looks really pretty. So this is how it looks so far. I think it looks great. I love how the river turned out. Um, and it's all about the little details. Um, so now I'm gonna move on and start uh, decorating the other half. So that's what I'll do um, in this clip.
All right, so I've decorated it and it's done. I made sure everything it can close. Um, one tip, just make sure to remove all the excess glue because I did leave a little bit in there, but it's okay. And now I'm just gonna add the tape, kind of to seal it all in, um, and just go all all around the the entire pokeball. Um, and you'll use a bottle cap to to kind of close it off. You use some glue. I forgot to paint it. You can paint it white. Um, but we're pretty much done, and that's it. Add that there, and you got yourself a Pokemon terrarium.